Hot damn. I feel like I'm in a Twilight Zone episode. That's how I feel. Interesting. You're traveling to another dimension. A dimension not only of sight and sound, but of mind. A journey into a wondrous land whose boundaries are that of the imagination. Your next stop, the Twilight Zone. Right here. Anybody here? Anyone? I don't know, it's a uh, this kind of an oddball thing, but it seems to me that there hasn't been a single soul here. Not a single soul. Hmm. I don't know, let's let's explore more. Yes, sir. Twenty eight days later. Oh, well, I think that's a uh, actually a huge plus for me. This is the uh, uh, monument in memory of the uh, Great War on these lands, 1877. Yes, sir. Well, it's the zombie apocalypse, so I guess I can uh, make some use of it, you know, you know. Hmm. Wow. I've been... Uh, I've been imagining wishing for this piece since I can remember. For ages. This is, by the way, our um, <clears throat> sort of the the uh, the town's biggest park. It's called Park Holy Forest or Sacred Forest. And this this was a sacred place uh, centuries ago. I think it still is a sacred place. It's not completely uh, urbanized. It's still a forest, more or less. But uh, it's the one place that I'm uh, sort of retreating when 
when uh, I wanna some I wanna get out of people and get some peace and quiet and uh, it's pretty uh, beautiful day today uh, so I reckoned I uh, I needed to get out and uh, take a walk uh, Uh, unlike some, well, unlike most people, staying inside and uh, in a state of fear, freaking out, being scared of this uh, crazy situation we find ourselves in right now. Do you know what that is? It's Chaos 19 in a nutshell. Maybe tomorrow it will be co uh, it will be named something different. Look. They even put these uh, sort of uh, how do you call this? Uh, emergency uh, anyways you get the idea emergency uh, s ceiling uh, plastic well I don't see the point at all no I'm just gonna find some decent place I'm just going to sit have a beer, enjoy the weather, it's spring now, and contemplate. Or if you wish, you can meditate. But uh, I won't be meditating today, just gonna chill, try to relax. and. When there's no people around, I'll be damned, not a single soul. Well, that, that makes, certainly that makes things even more peaceful and uh, authentic, real. And... Uh, Yeah, I've been here hundreds of times and there's always people playing around, kids screaming. This used to be, uh, this used to be, uh, uh, there was a running water here. Of course it's not running right now, it's not working. And uh, used to be working. I don't know what happens. It's not a drinkable water by any stretch of the imagination. Just to wash your hands and uh, refresh. But uh, it seems that the, our greedy fucking mayor cannot put some money to fix that. Anyways, this is, this is almost the end of the park. And I usually sit around this area where there are a lot of uh, beautiful pine trees and uh, birds chirping around and hopefully no people, you know. Some uh, some uh, little shitheads actually tried to destroy these um, resting spots. Look, just look. These little shitheads, retards, whatever, 
Meat golems. Meat golems. Wrecked the whole place. And uh, they even made some fire, but I don't, I don't think that's their invention. You know, this is not a bad spot. I'm not hearing anyone. Hopefully, I don't see any Gestapo uh, men here trying to lock me in. I'm not. Uh, what, was, what was the word I'm looking for? Damn it. I'm not cooperating in any of their schemes. You get what I mean? Well, I haven't seen any security by the way, which is odd. If I go there, well usually I go in this direction and I usually stay for a couple of hours. Sometimes I drink beer, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I read. Sometimes I just make some videos. Or just walk around. But uh, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Well, not really crazy, but uh, really strange really strange with a capital S strange it's bizarre I mean I don't know people uh, many people are uh, actually scared that it's quite understandable I don't blame them but uh, how can you just waste such a beautiful day and stay locked inside because the uh, TV and the social uh, media social networks and uh, the government said so that's uh, that's pretty sad actually I uh, I'm not not really happy about this situation to be honest but I have to adjust I have to adjust somehow you know because because you uh, when you get when you get outside you have to wait on a queue for hours to get some groceries groceries you have to queue in the uh, pharmacy to get some pharmaceuticals you have to wear a stupid mask which by the way I'm not wearing a stupid mask I have one in my bag because my uh, crazy father said I should wear I don't think so so no mask all right uh, and uh, yeah it's not it's not great And I, uh, I personally, I don't have a sp specific solid, um, well, opinion or argument where, from where this thing came, or if it's real, or if it's a, you know, problem, reaction, solution kind of thing, a conspiracy whatever you wish of course it could be anything but it's most likely not what they have presented it officially that is that is absolutely transparent and uh, I think many people, many uh, people who can
can uh, think for themselves are realizing that and things are fishy they stink and uh, what else as I said <clears throat> it's not good for the economy it's not good for jobs it's not good for anything people cannot travel people are freaking out look at that that is a pretty nice view. Let's just ch check something. Everyone's freaking out, you know. Uh, I'm not going there. I guess that's my place. That is where I'll be sitting. Enjoying the view. Boy, look at that. Well, it's not the best view. You have the highway there. Uh, that's the city. And there are some buildings there. But it's, uh, I guess, uh, I guess it's the best I can get today so that'll be it guys uh, I hope everyone is doing okay I'm trying to I'm trying to be relaxed and not to take everything as super absolutely mind-blowingly serious in some ways this is the zombie apocalypse we've been uh, war warned about waiting for or maybe if uh, any of you have seen the walking dead series or any other zombie movie tv series or whatever read any books uh, world war z this is kind of it and that movie Contagion and uh, Dean Kuntz's, uh, you know, predictions and all these things, you know, everyone is, everyone is absolutely right, in a way, and everyone is also absolutely wrong, in a way, and that's and that's how it's uh, that's how it's meant to be uh, probably and uh, things will be different from now very very different uh, if I don't I don't know if th that was the uh, the reset we've all been waiting for but uh, we we shall see in the following months or in the end of the uh, in the end of this year uh, in the meantime stay safe uh, look after your yourselves your uh, family friends relatives loved one loved ones keep them close and don't trust don't trust the media don't trust anyone as that fox motor saying or uh, passwords trust no one and uh, yeah I'm signing off for today see you around and uh, until next time Ciao. You unlock this door with a key of imagination. Beyond it, it's another dimension. A dimension of sight. 
a dimension of sound, a dimension of mind. It is an area which we call the twilight zone.